The I-5 Gateway Project is running ahead of schedule, and it's caught the eye of our neighbors to the south. A delegation of officials from Mexico toured the project to see what they might learn about road construction that could be used in Mexico. Pat Haslam joins us now with more. Pat? Hello, Ed. Hi, Anne. The officials were from an area of Mexico located about two and a half hours south of Mexico City, and they were really quite impressed with what they saw. The tour took place last Friday, and Mexican officials were told in detail how the project was designed, funded, and implemented with the goal of minimizing the impact of construction on the local community. In Mexico, we want to improve the, the road systems that we have, the highways, the, the, the municipalities, and, uh, and basically the reason that, that we see what is happening here is, is extremely attractive for us. The Gateway project is well over halfway done. It involves adding a carpool and a regular travel lane in each direction between the 91 Freeway and Artesia Boulevard. So what can Mexican officials learn that might be of benefit? I don't think uh, financially we will ever be able to execute projects as such. But the idea of the technology that we are taking with us is going to help us to improve upon what we already have. One point of the tour was to help the delegation find ideas they could take home and use on their own construction projects. Just how the cooperation between the state, the county, the Transportation Commission and the city works together on a major project like this that disrupts traffic through the city. See how we do things here. But just how can projects completed in the United States translate in Mexico? The highways that we have, they have to be reconstructed some areas and the technology that we so far we have seen it doesn't take uh, to be a scientific mm -hmm. i think uh, by watching what you do it's going to be a tremendous opportunity for us to make that change the 335 million dollar project is being funded by measure m as well as state and federal dollars it's the last project we promised the public the residents of orange county on the measure m that we would complete. And when it's finished, about 2011, the uh, funding from the, the original Major M will have been expended and the new Major M will kick in. Five freeway. Yes, we do. You notice that as soon as you hit the county line, it goes from all these beautiful lanes of traffic to four. Yeah, you it know, narrows right down. Each way. Uh, what's LA County planning on adding? The game plan is they're going to expand and widen out their portion of the I-5 all the way up to the 710 freeway. Hmm. I've heard different dates when they're going to begin construction, but don't look for anything for at least five years out of LA County. They don't have the money, yeah. and uh, they have not designed anything to the best of my knowledge. Okay. And the LA County officials I've spoken to are all saying more likely 2015 before they get started. Yeah. Ouch. Okay.